Keplida is a newer antipsychotic that's used to treat schizophrenia and a depressive episode in cases of bipolar disorder. Now, I haven't seen many people on this medication, although people that have been on it do find it helpful. It's pretty easy to dose. It's just one capsule taken at 42 milligrams. So it's thought that this medication blocks the dopamine D2 and blocks the serotonin 5-HT2A receptors. And the leading theory in psychosis these days, or at least in hallucinations, delusions, is that there's too much dopamine that is secreted in like the emotional center of the brain. And so this medication will calm that down by blocking the dopamine receptors and decrease that interaction. Also, it's thought that dopamine may play a role in mood disorders, like maybe depression has too little dopamine maybe bipolar has too high dopamine and so perhaps it helps regulate the dopamine levels in cases of bipolar depression to where it's indicated for that with all antipsychotics there's many possible side effects with this type of medication but most notably and what needs to be regularly monitored is the weight and the appetite so there can be a tend to increase cholesterol levels, increase blood sugars, and so periodically the cholesterol and the blood sugars should be monitored as these can affect over time. Also, this medication, like any antipsychotic, if taken over a long-term period, like several years, there can be increased chances of side effects like movement disorders, uh, meaning like they may people may notice shakes or tremors. Uh, it can be where, anywhere in where there's muscles in the body. It could be um, even around the mouth. And so these things can be pretty concerning because if it goes on long enough, it it can be permanent. And so be sure to keep an eye on it. If it happens, you can talk to your doctor, maybe get it addressed early. And it's possible that these symptoms go back to normal.